If you click the first link in my blog entry for today, you'll come to this video here on YouTube. And no, I'm not going to play it because I got enough bogus copyright strikes from YouTube as it is. You only need to view the first 12 seconds where they actually admit the Pope is going to play a part in an up-and-coming movie called Beyond the Sun. And yes, the inference to sun worship is always to be expected when it comes to pagan Rome. What amazes me is how blind the popes of Rome truly are when it comes to biblical as well as common sense here. I mean, absolutely everyone knows the first sin ever to be used by Satan was that he lied to one-third of heaven and conned all those angels to join him in a rebellion wherein hellfire is the end result for him, his angels, and every foolish human on the planet that cannot see the evidence of a creator and omnipotent God everywhere they look. As we also know, lying is the native tongue of Satan. In fact, the author of truth, Jesus Christ himself, stated the following when confronted by the Pharisees 2,000 years ago. He said, why do you not understand my speech? Even because you cannot hear my word, ye are of your father, the devil, and the lusts of your father ye will do. He was a murderer from the beginning, and abode not in the truth, because there is no truth in him. When he speaketh a lie, he speaketh of his own, for he is a liar, and the father of it. Every actor that has ever stepped on stage is in fact being used by Satan to fine-tune his vicious craft deep within the heart of mankind, because... The basic reality is that in order to act, you must literally lie for a living. In fact, notice what Johnny Depp said not too long ago on camera. Check this out. I never understood the fascination with the personal life of a, of a guy who tells lies for a living. Okay. He's talking about himself, obviously. And so why is it this pope and every pope before him always seems to keep missing the basic biblical reality of how any form of a lie is in fact a sin. And why does this Pope use lies to declare God creates people as homosexuals, like he did the other day, or who along with the last three Popes has openly lied to declare in writing that evolution is scientifically sound? And worst of all lies, all these Popes have declared Jesus is not needed for salvation, in writing no less. It's because this Pope and every Pope before him have been identified by the God of creation to be Antichrist. Absolutely every prophecy that has ever been uttered in the word of the eternal God have all been confirmed in historic record to have been fulfilled by the popes of the Roman Catholic Church. Not a few prophecies, not 90%, not even 99%. 100% of every prophecy about Antichrist is found fulfilled by the popes. And yes, I am fully aware that the Pope who is also the Jesuit, that has taken a vow to lie to every Christian he meets, this Pope is actually playing himself in the movie. But common sense dictates that he will still have to act as if all that surrounds the scene he is in is somehow actually reality, if he's to pull off his acting debut. But anyone with common sense knows it is not reality. He is acting a part. It's a movie. And just being in that film alone openly declares he is preaching to all of his flock that it is perfectly acceptable for each and every one of them to emulate the character of Satan, who is the father of lies, the first professional liar. Thank you for watching. God bless.